Did they? Swell up. Who was inside? They just ran straight in there. They just ran in. Jen, I've been with these guys for too long. That did not just happen. Next video? Yeah. Trace, what are we doing here? Dr. Ramirez, have you seen Harry and Dane? Dane was in here with me all day, working on the designs for the ski lift to get it working. I got pretty far. Of course, the cable still can't hold nearly the weight. I'm sorry, doctor, but they haven't been in here since then? Well, Harry's got his usual time reserved after hours, you know. Trace. Yes? Where are Harry and Dane? Listen, Dane found out, like, two hours ago. Oh, no. Are they both okay? Like, Listen, I don't know. How can you not know? Harry calls you his best don't friend. Don't on me. They told me to leave. Harry was doing his drop cloth thing like, oh, and I can fix this. We're all one big happy family. I try not to get involved with my students' affairs. It's nothing. It's personal. That makes it sound like Harry's pregnant, sir. Well, I'm glad to hear he's not. Okay. This is an acceptable crisis. We're on our own for the Bureau. I need you two to fill me in on everything Kyle Everett has done and said since he's been here. Okay. I can do that. Trace! Trace! Uh, go on ahead, Albright. Have you seen Adrian? When did you last see him? Adrian! Where were you? He was with me, Miss Gregg. Perfectly safe. And why was he with you? Don't talk about me like I'm not here, Kimber. I'm here. Okay. Why were you with him? I was looking for a job. What? I'm going to go work with Mr. Everett. Like Hattie James does, traveling around, helping people. I'm going to go be an assistant for the Federal Community Bureau. Reconstruction. Reconstruction. Don't bring my brother into this. What? Bring him into what? I think we've already had this discussion, Miss Gregg. I... Yes. I should think you'd like having your brother working for the Bureau. After all, we have access to certain supplies that you and your family might need. I can't pay for those supplies myself? That's under review. Ultimately, it is your brother's decision. Adrian, don't tell me you want to leave with them. I could help people, go out and change things. I told you to stay away from them. I decided this on my own. I'm not a kid anymore, Kimber. Well, you would have known that I'm being serious. You always act like I'm you have to protect me. Well, the minute I turn my back, you go into something like this. He'll be helping us with the transfer of power at Greendon. And then you want to travel with us, don't you, Adrian? Yeah. You still need me, Adrian. Of course I do. You think you can take my brother because I'm going to die? That's an easy fix. I won't die. Adrian, come on. We need to talk. You want to show loyalty? I, uh... Kimber. The reason I wanted to work with the FRB is so that I could travel and leave Greendon. But maybe... Was it wrong? I'm not I'm I'm not giving an excuse, but I I was also thinking that maybe I could get you your medication. I guess that's kinda kinda funny. Adrian, do you have the camera? Uh yeah, here. This is not the time for an interview, you Really? If you're gonna lie to me again, I want you to do it on camera. Kimber Gregg is going to kill someone. Tonight. No. No, I'm not listening to this again. I'm not falling for this again. Falling for what? You... You always do this. You find the dumb trusting one, and then you become my friend, and... 
then you start messing everything up. You work for the FRB. I don't know the circumstances of I that. Just and yet, I don't know. If you're some kind of spy, then everything comes crashing down around our ears. Kimber is a good person. I have to trust that. That or may be true. But we've all become desperate over three years. And that's what the FRB likes. Is there anything they have over Kimber's head? Anything at all? No. There's nothing. She would not sell out like that. Anyone would sell out like that. I was a rich scientist's daughter, and I stood back and let the FRB let settlements starve because the alternative was me dying in the desert. And that's what they do. The FRB finds people willing to do anything and then they make them do anything. This is how not on your side they are. Whatever. Kyle Everett gave her a bottle of gas in one of these matches. And he told her that he wants the lab gone as well as everyone in it. The lab meaning Harry's lab. Harry Fremont. They want, they think that if he's gone, Greendon's leadership will fall apart. Harry is in the lab. Yes. But you work for the FRB. How can I know You that can't. Harry's in the lab. And your friend, however much of a saint she is, is to blame. Charlie, I'm only trying to help you. Just trust me. Harry's in that building? According to Cal Everett. Okay. Oh, fuck it. No! Guys! Oh my god, Charlie! 